hi how is it going mine is good and fantastic today I'm feeling a bit um, like I want to tour the Kalahari Desert or the Sahara Desert or northern Kenya hmm I have an old trough which is made of concrete so that makes me feel like I have uh, rocks um, I have sand with me and I have Hawothias guys for those who are starting or who are beginning to love or think that they love flowers <laughs> if you think that you love flowers and you want to have one in your room one of the plants that you can have and the best of all that we really 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 want to disturb you and it can take a lot of bashing is the Hawothia if you can kill a Hawothia hmm, <laughs> I don't know what to say because it takes it takes a lot for it to, to die the only thing that you need to be aware of is how others don't like to be waterlogged so just make sure that your container has holes it can drain um, water easily and the soil that you're going to use uh, drains just as fast okay um, I have sand I'll put a little bit of sand I'll put pebbles I'll put compost I'll put manure um, and ensure that the Hawothias, where I put the Hawothias, there is a, um, there is no direct sun, because what happens if you put it under the direct sun, um, it gets sun scorched, sunburned. <laughs> yes, even plants get sunburned. So, yeah, that that you need to be aware of. Okay, so shall we get going? I hope you can do this with me. Yeah. Some activities that I do just don't prepare you for the kind of tool that you need. Who would have thought that I would be doing this? But yeah. So the truck is all clean. Squeaky clean. It's good to note that my trough doesn't have any holes, huh? so there will be no way that the water will be draining out. So I, I will be very, very conscious when I am watering the Hawothias. Just so as to measure how far, how much soil I should have. So I'll use this as a, the sign of, they will help me figure out the depth. And notice I'm not I could add more here. I could actually fill it up, but I've noticed that there are quite a number of uh, the young ones that are showing up. So that's a good sign because I could just remove and spread them through. I guess that's a good thing to do. Okay. The mix is now ready. Um, so all we need is to spread it. And again, just um, put the Hawothias in the respective spaces. And you can just plant. It's that simple. It is that simple. Uh, just a few tips. Hawothias, they don't like too much water. Um, but again, they don't like direct sun. If you give them direct sun, then they get sun scorched. The last time I said sunburned, which is still okay because <laughs> plants also get sunburned yeah it's not just our skin but yes how are theirs they don't like a lot of um yeah direct sun so as you can see this has stayed for quite some time without enough water but that's not a big deal for this for this um this plant
you can cut. They're very hardy, so you can, you can do whatever you want with them. They won't die, they don't die off. They just stay there waiting for water and they continue growing. So don't be shy. This I can just um, create space for them. This is a huge one. Nice. You could also just reduce the amount of soil to allow it to take advantage of the fresh and the one that has manure in it. Yeah. All that has come off. Even this can come out, really. Ooh. <laughs> it should still grow, amazingly. Now that we're done with the planting, I guess the next thing would be to think of how does the container look. You know you can't, you can't, you can't, yeah? Sit, sit, sit. Okay, now the battle of the titans. You leave your mother alone. Okay, just give her some peace. Now that I am done with the planting, I guess the next thing is to think of uh, the, the presentation how how do they look when I look at the at the at the plants are they popping do they look beautiful do they look nice right now it's a bit dull so why don't I just do something Final chaffu, and I guess this will do. And off we go with the Again, okay, sit down, sit, sit. What do you want now? What is it? Today you are just another one. <laughs> just before these guys decide now, I don't belong here. This is not my space. Um. <laughs> we can see each other in a few months just to check on how the how are doing. Dear, you dare. Dear. 